all right so back um again and like i said in the last video uh, i was going to just make the changes and then come back so what we ended up taking out was zeta Bla uh, moonlight and a dire wolf even though i really like this card because it actually wanted me to duel we're going to take those out and we're going to replace it with a a a akashic magician turn of uh, tornado dragon and baguska and the reason why Ak akashic magician is so good is because all it needs is two monsters with the same type and we're playing zombies folks so that's just even better and then especially with goblin zombie we can do some things with this um i actually want to build like a deck around this card but we'll see all right so let's get into some duels all right folks so we are going in with the second uh video of the day and we've opened up pretty pretty okay this requires a lot of setup this mistake is very good but possibly not good with it not possibly but it's not good with this goblin zombie and we're going up against brand fusion you know what i really hope that he's playing zombies so he can banish the spirit master and we can just pop his other card no he's playing world chalice god dang it um so yeah man we're about to get uh we're about to get fleeced and beasted there's not really too much we can do about this there's not really too much oh he's playing Valor. see a lot of people told me Valor was uh, is garbage but I, I think Valor's is actually pretty good uh, dude, let me check the damn graveyard oh my god Okay, let me check the what? Oh, you must already have it. Let me see. Oh, it's July Lazuli. Okay. He must already have it, folks. And if he doesn't have it, he's just bad. Okay, well, he didn't need it. <laughs> he did not need it at all. Um, but once he needs, actually, he does need it. Does need it, man. Uh, well, this mistake would have been very good. It would have stopped the lead. But besides that, I don't think mistake is really good against this deck. Um, so we know he has the normal in his hand. I'm pretty sure he has the level five in his hand. Um, I can't prove it, but I'm pretty sure he has the level five. Um, and if this shine ball come out of his hand, we're we're just in we're we're in we're in real good territory. Nope. Um, please just do not have the level five, and we're all good. We're all good if you don't have the level five. But I, I think I know he has it. I know he has it. There's no reason not to search it off the lead. Yep, see, told you he had it. So this is not gonna end up too good. And he he, he decided he did want to hit. And I believe we don't what are you doing? Oh, he don't know how to play. He doesn't know how to play Royal Chalice. What are you doing? I never hit. There's literally no reason to go into Link Sprider right now. You go into what's the name? Oh, he messed up. What well, I don't understand. What are you doing? Okay, well, you know what? Let me not judge him. Let me let him play the game because maybe I, I'm not. Maybe I don't know what I'm doing. But I thought you would go to the World Chalice Dragon. That's I mean M Duke, which I uh, actually uh, sided to get hit because I really felt like this was going to be an underdog sleeper deck. And I'm surprised that this deck doesn't do. You know what? You know why this deck is not doing good? It's not because it's a bad deck. It's because everybody's playing nine to ten hand traps in every deck. This is why this deck cannot function because there's so many so many hand traps being played you can't really you can't really do anything about it and for what see like this is why i said he messed up he's gonna have to do some awkward plays he's just wasting cards right now um he's probably gonna have to get rid of these two um but i'm pretty sure he's probably gonna get rid of these two um to go into ib up here um he can actually do no nope, he has to do these two to go to ib and then Actually, he can't. He messed up. I told you. Yeah, this is why I said he shouldn't have did this. Actually, what he can do is use these three to go into um, the one, uh, the Trigate Wizard, and then the Trigate Wizard would uh, open up two more zones, and then he can use War Chalice to get the two cards out. Um, but like I said, yeah, he messed up when he, when he when he did this first. Like he was not supposed to do Venus first. This was supposed to be like a like this was not supposed to like you weren't supposed to use the effect first. That's what I meant to say. Like you're not supposed to use the effect first. You're supposed to get your Seraphonite off and then go into a world, ch go into M Duke up here and then use him. Yes, yeah, so he's going to go try Gate Wizard. Um, what? What is going on here, folks? I, I just don't understand. This is why Skullmaster is good. But yeah, <clears throat> the, the reason what did like I know a lot of people say, oh, the deck is garbage. You shouldn't play it. The deck is really, really good, and it's it's always going to be good because of links. But the problem is that we have we have hand traps now. Before hand traps really weren't that powerful, 
I mean, yeah, they could, they could, yeah, I'm pretty sure he was going to quit. Be right back. And I get punished. Look, they said I did recently quit. That doesn't make sense. But yeah, um, hand traps back then, like Effect Veiler, um, Maxi, why they can, you know, swing the duel. Oh, this is a good hand. Um, why did they can swing the duel in your favor? And, you, you know, you could stop your opponent's key play. They were never as powerful as what's the name. Like, uh, Ash Blossom is like literally says, stop. Effect Veiler, you at least can keep the monster. Maxi, he doesn't negate all your effects, but like cards like Drone Lockbird, um, cards like Gamma, it's they're just way too they negate and destroy, which is just way too good. Way too good. Why is Ectoplasma the turn player must tribute one faced up monster? Okay, um, okay. So let's just do this because I don't know what this man is playing. Okay, some type of burn deck. Um, no, I don't want to use Bozuki's, but yes, I do want to use that. Um, I actually could have possibly beat him because of that. Ooh, there's a Goblin Zombie. So yeah, we're just we're just in the thing. So this is why I say like Akash Magician is really good because what we can do here is do that to get back Gozuki. No need to. Um, and then we can go this, right? And then we could send you. Um, we could send the. Well, we already have a Mizuki in the grave, so don't need that. We could send this guy. This is just very good. So, bam, right? Then we can go Goblin Zombie. Bam. And then we. I mean, we. we I, 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 I just befuddled that super hard. <laughs> That was dumb. Um, I don't know what I, I should have sent Mizuki. I don't. I don't know what I was thinking just now. Um, now we can go uh, Akash Madulthin, right? We can just go in right here. Um, it does not matter. Um, bam, and then this can add a solitaire. And um, yeah, that was stupid. I, I don't know why I did that. To be honest with you. But we're gonna just, <laughs> that was the bad play. That one right there was bad. I should have sent Mizuki. Um, also because I have, yeah, I should have sent Mizuki. Oh, so Jamas. Okay, so what I should have did was sent Mizuki in that situation. So I could search whatever I want with Goblin Zombie, Mizuki the Zombie. Yeah, like I, I completely had game. I could have blew his old board and attacked your game. Um, but no, I just wanted to mess up. But like I said, man, I really believe Akash Magician is very good. Anyways, he, he's a all right, so last duel of the video, um, and let's see if we can actually get some actual good things. And I'm not gonna mess up, but yeah, like I said, man, hand traps are so oppressive now. It's just like there, you can't really play a bunch of decks because, like, right here, let's say if he's actually playing Westerny, like he's sending, right? I can Ash Blossom, and what does he do after that? All right, you know, Ghost Ogre is, you know, not really that, like, see, look, a good Ash Blossom. And his play, I mean, he can end with a Westerny, but that's not gonna really do anything. I, you know what? I, I think I can. Uh, no, yeah, this game is over. <laughs> this game is over. Jesus Christ! But yeah, man, like, like if he has an Ash Blossom, we're just. Wait a minute. We can possibly still win here. No, he gets B. Oh, he knows how to play. He knows how to play. What? Okay, now I'm confused. But it doesn't really matter. But. Yeah, okay. Well, that's what wait what you must have a in your hand. You're that good Oh, he's that good. He has oh, no, he didn't even need a he just no He just needed any ABC in his hand You're that good. Okay. Well, that's fine Um, oh you have a Oh, you just hard drew a I Literally was playing against I was playing against uh, this deck after the YCS is over, and he had set rotation, uh, terraforming, he had the same hand every time. Like, it is not fair. Um, but, yeah, like like this, Ash Blossom would have stopped literally all this. But, like, if I Ash Blossom Union Hanger, what, what, what does he do? Um, well, that's cool. I guess we have to do this, huh? And this is, uh, this is what's going to have to happen. Nothing else I can do about this. He's down to 4,000, so we could possibly even, we could kill him. Yes, we can, huh? We sure, to, we sure can. 
if he leaves anything in attack mode, we, we beat him. Pretty sure he isn't, but um, we can literally beat him if he leaves something in attack mode. But I'm pretty sure he isn't. Um, I wonder what I want to do here, though. Pretty sure he's going to add a B back to his hand. He's going to special summon C, which would be the smartest thing to do. Okay. Oh, he is going to summon some. Oh, no, he doesn't. Okay. Hmm. How do I want to play? I can just go Baguska and wait. But then he can just link. Um, hmm. How do I get over this? Is this unaffected by monsters? Uh, let me see. It's unaffected by opponent's monsters effects, but that's that's completely fine. Uh, we could actually, what can we We can do a lot here, actually, folks. What we can do is I can go, I can go Omega. You can go Omega and then I can go Baguska and then hope that we don't lose. But I'm pretty sure we will because he has. Hmm. See, I could send Gozuki, right? And Gozuki could send. Well, folks, I guess we're, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to play this one out. Let's target you. It's not affected by monster effects, so it's not gonna increase, which is fine. Um, we're gonna do this. We're gonna ditch that, and then we're gonna further go Suki. Then what we can do with Gozuki is we could send the send Spirit Master. All right, then we can go into a we can go with Guska, but that is not gonna do anything. Um, so we can Castell back the no, I don't want to Castell that back. I can go Beals, but then that doesn't do anything. I can go Shogun Saga, that doesn't do anything. I can go Omega, that doesn't really do anything. I think it does something, I guess. Um, yeah, go Zuki's effect. I'm gonna banish this. And no. Special summon this guy. Spear Master to pop this. Let me see. He has A, B, C in his grave. And he needs another A, B, and C. Which is, I don't know, I feel like that's fine. I feel like we can come back from this. Let's return this Mizuki. Hopefully he doesn't have like a ghost order or something. And he has the twin twister just, just literally sitting in his hand. Forced, huh? I'm just forced to do it. There's nothing else I can do about that. Uh, yep, let's banish Spirit Master, and then we can return to Mizuki. And then we can use this to bring back Spirit Master. Bam. I mean, then we can bait what's the name out. I mean, he's going to go Dragon Buster right here. Um... Oh, no, he's going to start normal summon. Okay, well, we're going to just activate this. So now we're not going to lose our Wesson name. There's B, so that means he can only go into one, which is completely fine. I do not know why he summoned A, but yeah, man, like I was saying, man, hand traps really just like Ghost Reaper, cards like that. You just, oh, wow. Why did you do that? <laughs> what did you do that for? Why did you do that? I have game. What are you doing? And this is exactly why I don't like what's the name either. Like, I, this is why I specifically don't like Destrudo because of this. This is why you don't. Oh, my God. No. Thank you, Brian. Thank you, Brian. Thank you. Because now we're just going to just this for no reason. I, I don't know why he went Castell. That was stupid. That was really stupid. That was just really stupid. That was just really dumb, man. That was really dumb. There was no reason to go Castell. Um... Wait, let me see. Have uh, one spirit master, so that means there's another one in the grave. Just send Mizuki. Let me see. Yep, there's another one in the grave, and that's 4,500. Um, once he, I, I still don't understand why he did that, but I, I thought he was gonna just go Dragon Buster and attack over my stuff. But nope, bad mistake by him. But yeah, that is it. 
for this duel. Um, big mistake by him. Huge mistake. And yeah, be right back. Don't know why everybody wants to play slow when we play this deck. But yeah, man, we we, we Western name. We won again. So once again, shout out to Brian Johnson for the deck list. And that is it for this video. So stay tuned for another video because we're going to go in one more time. And we're going to see how good this deck is can do this is why I, this, this deck is so good because we can go into level fours constantly bam you know we talked to spirit master we can go to level eight we can go into level four we can link we can do whatever we want now i want to try to fit more links in here because with akash magician um we can do some we can do some wonderful stuff we can do some real wonderful stuff but yeah stay tuned for the next duel be right back thank you guys for watching if you guys would like to support the channel all i ask for you guys to do is click and add that'll be enough and yeah be right back